give you a little clean. Monday morning clean. Good morning, guys. Good morning. How you? What are you doing in here? What the heck are you doing in my car? Of course, I kicked off Monday morning with a workout. The only way to start your week: getting up, getting in the gym. One thing I just want to say before I get going, I have got to go in a second, otherwise I'm going to be late. A lot of people blame things in life because it's unfair, because it's not fair that it's happening to them. There is no such thing as fair, guys. If something negative happens to you in your life, if you're hit with a scenario that you weren't expecting, unfortunately, that's just life. You've got to just take it on and turn it into the most positive situation you can. Learn out of that experience and grow. If you sit there dwelling for a year, two years, 10 years, the rest of your life, that it's unfair that it happened to you, are you really gonna let that one experience affect the rest of your life? If somebody breaks up with you, are you gonna let that break up affect the next five years of your life? Or are you just gonna say, yeah, that's shit. Yeah, life is unfair, but that's happened. And I've gotta move on. And I've gotta just accept that life is unfair. It's unfair for me, it's unfair for you, it's unfair for everybody. Will Smith spoke on his Instagram stories the other day about happiness and about how you really are and should be the only person in control of your happiness. If somebody else is making you unhappy, cut that person out of your life because you, you are in charge of what makes you happy and making sure that you do that more regularly. You are in charge of letting things get to you, things bring you down you are in charge of your life and your happiness. So just remember that. Next time you're unhappy, you're the one in control. You've got to flip the situation. You've got to bring yourself happiness. And if you're relying all your happiness on somebody else, yo, that's toxic. That is not, if you literally rely on somebody else to keep you happy, that's dangerous, man. That's dangerous. You need to, you need to be able to be happy in yourself. I was trying to skateboard whilst having Nala with me, but she was so scared, so I've had to pick it up. So my friend Lawrence, who lives in the Netherlands, who was over on the weekend you saw in the vlogs, we're working out together, is literally having lunch around the corner of one of my other friends, Ned, who also doesn't live in Brighton. He's currently traveling the country on tour, doing a musical, and they both just happen to be having lunch. Literally in town. Skinny boys. <laughs> you good? Yeah, you all right? Yeah, man, good, good. Just come back to the office. I haven't shown you guys this yet. Do you want separate ones? We have got, yeah, let's do one in each. We've got a Tango Ice Blast machine in the office. Oh my God. I don't know if this is the best thing ever or the worst thing ever. The best, obviously. Perfect. Finished up the day in the office. So happy about this. Currently got Nala in the car. Zoe's in the car in front of me because we stupidly drove in. Well, actually not stupidly because Zoe had a meeting an hour before me today. She was in the office pretty damn early. We had a new member of the, I mean, you can't just cross. People are stupid, aren't they? <laughs> People just crossing whilst I'm driving. We had a new member of the team joining Zoe's team today, which was really, really exciting. I'm sure she'll tell you more about who she is, what she does and everything like that in her vlogs. So that went really well. And then now we've just jumped in the car and Zoe and I are heading off to Pets at Home to go and get some new dog bowls. Because if you saw the vlogs the other day, we got some new dog bowls for Nala and Buzz. But um, let's just say they didn't want to drink out of them. Apparently it's because the bowls were shiny that they could see their own reflection and they were scared and that's why they didn't want to... Crazy. Such fussy little dogs. Who's that, Nala? Who's that? Is it Mummy? She literally didn't care. <laughs> I thought she was going to be so excited. Oh, look at her little tail. 
I don't think she understood it was you through the window. No, she was just not. like, oh. Someone's there, but who is it? <laughs> Look at the little rabbits on the top. They're feeding each other like Buzz and Nola. They're so cute. Do you know what makes me sad? What? They might go to different homes and never see each other again. Oh no, I never think of that. They could be best pals. Should we just get them both? Yeah. I like the one with the beard. Let's see if she knows where to go. I'm just going to straight follow her. Oh, she's found the treats. They've got the bowls. Let me see. See, look, they reflect. Oh, no, no you can't see yourself. They've got much. like a spiral. Oh, no, no, all... this one's not. Look, it's got a spiral. Oh, Do you see? So yeah. you can't see yourself. Okay. Let's get five. Oh. Let's just get all four. We, don't need... we might as well just get no, too many. Someone else whose dog also won't eat out the other bowl and they'll, they'll, they'll need one. one. Okay, we'll just get three. We only need three. Oh, I think someone's hurt himself. Hey! Uh, what are you doing now? I'm off to London. Are you going to go straight to London? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh, I'll see you in like two months. Have fun. See you in a while. Bye. Cockadoll. This is where I'm going. The one and only. Before I go to London, I'm just going to grab a Nando's. Can I get a double chicken wrap, medium, with halloumi inside? Yeah bro, I'm coming, I'm just ordering a Nando's now, to be able to eat on the train. To go through like contract stuff and everything, so he's writing up um, like the, the offer and the contract and things. I love it when I get on a train, I get told it's kind of Victoria. Definitely isn't. Just had to get off that, uh, um, I don't even know where I am. Oh, okay. London Bridge City Pier. Guess I'm at London Bridge Station. Oh yeah, London Bridge. I have no idea if that's even close to where, to where I'm meant to be going. I was meant to be at Victoria Station. Got told to get on the wrong train. Should have checked. Stupidly just listened to the guy. Whereabouts do you live? <laughs> I don't know where I am. Do you know how long that will take? Uh, it's not the it's not the I'm in that half, an hour. half an hour. Perfect, thank you. Thank you. I literally get out of my taxi, look up, and look at <laughs> That's literally Ryan up there. That's where I'm going. Going up. I definitely didn't just fall asleep in that taxi. And to make it even worse, I had my headphones in and my sunglasses on. So the guy was like, hey, excuse me, mate. Excuse me, mate, we've made it, we're here, we're here. And I was just like. Oi, I knew that. Don't even test me. Don't even test me, boys! Don't test me, boys! It's blocked! Oh, <laughs> on, Straight away, it's not the coffee over. Bro! How's it going? Nerf guns. Well, yeah, I knew there was going to be something when I walked through that door. I knew it. I've been told to get my vlog camera quick. Nah. No, bro. An animal. Focused. Okay, you can hear it. Where are you, boys? <laughs> okay, you, you think you need to control things? <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do you know how small that is, bro? <laughs> that's, that's what we said. Like, it's not going to pump it fast. <laughs> this is what we need to be ready. So I 
kind of didn't explain why I'm here in London, you all know my friend Ryan rang me up earlier on because he's putting a bouncy castle on his penthouse balcony and I need to get down here to come and do it. Alfie, I needed you here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> this is history. <laughs> This is history in the world. Alfie needs to on. be here. I couldn't have done this without him. <laughs> oh. Yo, this jump looks sketchy, bro. I don't know about this. Yeah, I'll go. I'll I don't go. know about this. This is it. Yeah, it's the double <laughs> thing. This is going to give us like a bit of more of a, uh, a cushion. Better padding. And it's just cool. I'm really excited. Are you ready? Yeah. Are you jumping as well? Oh! Has it gone? Has it gone? <laughs> Alfie! No! Get the camera! The dolphin! No! The dolphin, the dolphin went off! What? No! Where's the dolphin? Where's it gone? You guys were baffled. Where's it gone? It went off the edge, I don't know. No! These guys are down there like completely baffled right now. They have no idea. I tried I tried to put the dolphin in here and it just it's not even windy right now. <laughs> Are you going to get it? Yeah, I'll go. Oi, shut up, is it just Amazon, waiting there? Amazon Prime. It's just Amazon waiting Prime. there. As if it was just down there waiting on the floor. That prime delivery though. <laughs> This bouncy castle is like dead. Look at it. I was gonna try and do some flips and stuff on it, but look, you can't even bounce, man. It just sucks everything out. No way. Do you see what I'm saying? I'm on the ground. You can't do it, can you? No way. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. These guys are having a jumping competition. Look, I, apparently Kota can jump further than me. Maybe higher, I admit maybe Thank higher, you. but I don't think further. We're gonna show you, okay. like, you want to do <laughs> Really? Oh, yeah. How do you Who got small ones? Who got big ones? Yes. Get in the slow-mo. Get in the slow-mo. <laughs> do you think you got that? Right, let me, yeah, easy. Kota's like an athlete. I'm just a free runner. Okay. I'm just here. He's like... He'll get it, he's wait. Oh! You like Damn! Bro, you could have cleared that. I reckon you could get that. Oh, Whoa. yeah! Flip off, flip off! Yeah! Savage! <laughs> Rizzy, you got it, bro! Yeah. <laughs> you could clear that, though. Oh! Oh, yes. <laughs> yes, man. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, good, thank you. How are you? Very good, thank you. Say hi to your sister if you want. Hi, Shabby. <laughs> How are you? I've got to run for my train. Is this Brighton? Oh, the front train. So I'm already nine minutes late for the train, but it's been delayed, which is super lucky. See you later. See you later. Woo! Always editing, guys. Editing the vlog that you're currently watching before I've even finished filming it. One step ahead of the game. I knew I'd forgotten something. I just felt it. Like the whole time on the train just then, I've been like checking my pockets, been like wallet, phone, work phone, camera, keys. I've got everything. 
except for my skateboard. Left my blooming skateboard in London. And I think Ryan's flying to LA tomorrow now. Ah. Oh. Right, it's time to end the vlog and go to bed. I would love to stay up and carry on editing this video if you're watching. But it's currently, okay, it's not too bad. It's 20 minutes to midnight. I was like this close to deciding to just stay with the boys tonight and stay over. Um, but I've got the gym at 7.30 tomorrow morning with my personal trainer, so no late night stupidness and then waking up tired tomorrow, back at a fairly reasonable time, hitting the gym tomorrow morning. If you've enjoyed the vlog, guys, if you enjoyed the craziness, if you enjoyed the randomness, the fun, give the video a thumbs up. Let's see how many, let's see if we can hit 30,000 thumbs up. I haven't given that challenge for a while. So right now, if you're still watching, go down below, hit the thumbs up, leave a comment. I'll reply to as many as I possibly can tomorrow. I've got a really sick day planned tomorrow and Wednesday and just all of this week because the weather is meant to be so nice. It's meant to be like 21 degrees. I've planned like some fun stuff. We've got a friend coming down tomorrow who you guys love in the vlogs and Zoe's hanging out as well. And finally get my hair cut. Oh, on that note, I was going to say I'm get my hair cut tomorrow. The reason why I've got a hat on is because my hair looks awful at the moment. And when I was on the train on the way back, I was like, oh, Ryan, I've got one of your new hats on. I'm so sorry, bro. I forgot to give it back to you. Big love to Ryan for letting me uh, wear one of his hats tonight. Anyways, guys, I'll catch you tomorrow. Good night.